Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises, glory, and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Akarmadash. Shalom to the elders of Great Millstone for pushing the words with fans to serve. And shalom to the Akim, scattered the four corners of the globe, pushing the words with fans to serve as well, too. I say shalom to the Akim out there. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to bring out. Uh, bringing out the Holy Scriptures first and pertains to this uh, news article that I'm about to just uh, bring out. And this is from BibleGateway.com, KJV version of the Holy Scriptures, and it reads Matthew uh, 24 and 6. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Uh, see that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Matthew 24 and 7. And it reads to the Holy Scriptures For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Matthew 24 and 8. All these, all these are the beginning of sorrows. And this is a uh, news article. It pertains to the scriptures that I just brought out. And definitely this is a uh, wars, rumors of wars right here. And this is a news article from the Associated Press News dot com published by Hong Jim Hong. Uh, published by Hong Jin Kim and Kim Thong Hong, published by them two hours ago from the Associated Press News dot com, and it reads: North Korea launches two ballistic missiles towards the sea in protest of uh, U.S. South Korea military drills. It says, uh, Seoul, South Korea, Associated Press, North Korea launched two short-range ballistic missiles. It says, uh, towards its eastern waters on Thursday. Its neighbors say it. it's a resumption of weapons tests to protest the just in South Korean U.S. live fire drills that is viewed as an evasion rehearsal. The launch are the first by North Korea since it fails to put its first spy satellite into orbit in late May. South Korea, uh, South Korea's Joint Chief of Staff said the missiles were launched from North Korea's capital region and travel about 780 kilometers to 480 miles before landing in waters between the Korean Peninsula and Japan. It caused, it caused the launch a grave pro provocation. It says South Korea's military will remain for readiness in close coordination with the United States. Japanese Prime Minister Fumo Koshida said the missile landed inside Japan's exclusive economic zone. He called the launch a violent action that threatens international peace and safety. So yeah, that's a rumor of war right there. As I bring it out once again, and I'm gonna uh, go to verse uh, verse six, Matthew 24 and six, and ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Right, ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Of uh, those, uh, the latest firing of those uh, two short-range ballistic missiles right along the Korean Peninsula, right along to the eastern sea of Japan as well too. So that's stirring up tensions between North Korea versus South Korea, Japan, and the United States. Those tensions are escalating. As uh, North Korea fired those missiles in protest of uh, South Korea and the United States doing those. Currently, they're doing these uh, live drill, mi military exercise drills in Korea. Look at that as a, re a rehearsal of a potential invasion right along the Korean Peninsula. So that's a prime example of our wars and rumors of wars right there. So with that, hopefully this lesson was edifying of this reading of this news article and the holy scriptures that I just brought out, Matthew 24 through verse 6 through verse 8, and pertains to this news article from the Associated Press, Associated Press News by, uh, dot com by Hong Jin Kim and Kim Thong Hong two hours ago. As it says again, 
North Korea launches two ballistic missiles towards the sea in protest of U.S. South Korea military drills. So with that, once again, hopefully this lesson was edifying. I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Akarnadash. Shalom to the elders of Great Millstone for preaching the word truthfully and sincerely. Shalom to the Akim, scattered the four corners of the world, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well too. And until next time, I will say Shalom.